New this morning, a sneak peek at some of the new rail cars that will replace Marta's entire fleet over the next several years. Marta is spending $646 million to replace its aging fleet. Now the first of the 224 rail cars arrived in Metro Atlanta this week. They're soon going to be on their way to Salt Lake City where they'll be decked out with new high tech features that will take a little while. But 11 Alive's Jerry Carnes is live at Marta's South Yard facility for a virtual tour of what the new rail cars will look like once they're finished. Jerry, have you worked on your virtual reality skills? I'm working on it. These uh, virtual tours have been a lot of fun. Once I lower these goggles, you'll be able to see what I'm seeing on a screen to my right. To my left is Jonas uh, with the company that is putting all of this together, designed and uh, are building these these new rail trains and I'm going to put the goggles down and you can see I'm now in the conductor seat. This is what the conductor will see on these new trains. That looks probably a lot like what they've seen before. I go to the right and then down the train right here. What you might notice is that the aisles on the new trains will be wider. That will allow more room for wheelchairs. It will allow more room for bicycles and for luggage. And there are phone charging stations nearly everywhere you go. There's one right over there. It's too far away for me to reach the uh, to re reach the phone. Uh, of course, the community got involved in this. They were able to take a virtual tour of these trains and they asked for some of these features like the phone charging stations. There you go. Put that back there. That doesn't belong to me. Uh, Jonas, talk a little bit about timing here. When will we see these trains on the tracks in Atlanta? Yeah, so we, we started with the development in January of 2020. We're now finishing the first car body welded in Europe. We're sending them over here to the US. They're making a stop in Atlanta, going to Salt Lake City, Utah, and we're building their car to the final truck, uh, to the final trains, bringing them back here to, uh, uh, to Marta around like 2024 then we're going in intensive testing and in 2025 they will be available for the public 2025 okay. yes i think i may have my back to the camera now do i, I it, i'm walking down a train i don't even know where the camera is i've got a baby carriage here so uh we'll put this aside and we'll take another tour coming up in the next half hour we'll take a look at the outside of the train then uh, and some important features there everyone in the studio is yelling don't take the baby don't take the baby <laughs> we're rooting for you jerry great job <laughs>